right, drink a sip of tea before I start. Kind of a pre-video ritual for me, hold. It's really good cold too. Hey, stranger, hey, what's what's going on? It's your boy, remember I'm Casey, Mr. Strongbro, you know that channel you unsubscribed to about two months ago? Yeah, I know who all of you are. I know who unsubs, who only watches like 50 seconds of my video and clicks off, and YouTube tells me this stuff, okay? I know who you are, user 62547389, and I am coming after your butt. Another sip of tea, calm down a little bit. Okay, obviously I'm joking, YouTube doesn't tell me exactly who does that stuff. <laughs> but I am curious to know who does. But guys, it feels really good to be back in front of the camera again, because it's been, feels like it's been a long, 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 long time. I made some TikToks here and there, but I haven't really had that much time to sit down, make a full video, and uh, edit everything. I've also been kind of editing Stuart's video on the side and uh, it's taking a really 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 long time. Cross between we had shutdown, my job was like having some weird crazy hours but even before, during shutdown, after shutdown, but I can't put the blame entirely on that because even far beyond that, I mean I've been gone for pretty much two months on YouTube. Majority of it is my fault for not just sitting down to make time for it. I may have already said this in the video in the past, but I just feel like so lost, lost on YouTube. Like the same, so doing the same stuff I was doing just seemingly wasn't working. I was kind of getting tired of editing the same game, like same similar games concepts. And I, I actually absolutely hated Friday Night Funkin' at one point. I can't even watch Friday Night Funkin' videos because the game's so dang hard. Other people make it look so easy. Like I like the music and everything, but to try to sit here for two hours to beat a part, especially on easy. I was playing on easy and it was still really difficult. Then you got to consider going to edit. That's like three, four hours worth of editing right there, trying to uh, cut a lot of stuff out. By the way, check out my Hunter x Hunter shirt. I st oh, this is another reason why I haven't made YouTube videos. I have been binge watching. A lot of good, uh, good anime. I've been away from anime for a while, and man, it's so good to be back in the anime world. Of course, I've been re-watching anime, re-watching One Piece and stuff, and then I finally did watch Demon Slayer. That's the first new anime I've watched in forever, and it's been good. So I was like, man, I haven't watched Hunter x Hunter. I have got to watch this amazing show, and oh my god, I cannot believe I haven't started that sooner. That's like one of the best animes out there. Also, I started the Tackle on Titan. Man, that is just heart-wrenching right there. Eren is absolutely the best, and I'm not, I'm not just saying this because he's the main character. I'm saying this because Aaron's just absolute boss, dude. There's a lot of good characters on that show, but Aaron's absolutely... Back on topic, where the heck was I? I'm at a crossroad on YouTube because I have nowhere to go. No freaking idea what games I want to play if I even want to continue games on a gaming channel at that point. I've had other ideas. I started a second YouTube channel, haven't uploaded anything to that. I kind of wanted to be more like lifestyle based for like my plant based lifestyle, jiu jitsu, working out. I think that's going to be a good idea. Just kind of branch off and try different things. Uh, TikTok has been pretty fun. A couple videos done really good on TikTok. So I'd say I probably uploaded more TikTok videos than I have YouTube videos this year. That might be exaggerating. It's very quick, easy, not really hard to edit stuff, but some people expect you to upload like twice a day on TikTok. And it's like, nah, I I'll be lucky to upload once a week. But I also thought about revisiting a couple games with uh, with my daughter. She absolutely loves Little Nightmares. She loves Minecraft. Another game she likes. What's the other one? She likes Dark Deception. Actually, I need to continue Dark, Dark Deception. That game has become something incredible. It did well on the channel. I don't know why I went, I never went back to it. Dark Deception was actually one of the games that kind of gave Levy a hard time at first, like gave her nightmares. So now every time we kind of want to mess with her and scare her, like there's a sound in like the other room where somebody's like, it's a monkey, don't go in there. She just gets so freaked out. She loves it though. She loves it. We're not traumatizing her. I can't believe I literally just tapped the mute button on accident. How do you even do that? How? Sorry guys, technical difficulties, I'm rusty. Every time we hear something in the other room, we kind of mess with it. He's like, there's a monkey in there. Daddy, there's a monkey under the bed. Go look. Yeah, I'm definitely going to H-E double hockey sticks. But now she actually really loves playing the game. So I really, like, only time I sat down to play games is really with her lately. I was playing Dark Souls for a bit. Then I also kind of felt like it wasn't being well received on the channel. I'm on like the last boss. I'm like the soul of Cinder is the final boss of the game. I'm just holding it off because I want to live stream it. So I guess whether or not it's well received, I still want to finish the, uh, finish that on the channel. Boom, finish Dark Souls 3 completely. But I still been putting time into jujitsu. My jujitsu journey has been just absolutely Absolutely fun. It's actually really incredible to look back and see how far you come because I just started back training sometime last year in June and I've really felt like I've come a long way. I've learned a lot. It's actually no surprise that this channel has kind of been falling because I mean I haven't really been uploading uploading a lot of videos. The regular daily views have dropped dramatically. Subscribers are being lost. I, I'm, I'm actually in the negatives right now. I'm not even gaining subscribers. It's either like zero for the month 
or we've lost like two. I guess I could kind of see a parallel between YouTube and jiu-jitsu. Like I've been putting this time in the jiu-jitsu, which has been great. I do not regret it. There's really only going forward the more you train or the more you uh, more you continually drill techniques. And I got to kind of relate a parallel to YouTube. The more you do YouTube, the more you upload videos, of course, the more momentum you have going forward. I just feel like it's a little more going forward on, on jiu-jitsu than it is YouTube. And it's less been less discouraging, honestly. So it's been more of a stress reliever for me because YouTube's just been stressing me out. I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. I kind of want to hang up the hat on gaming and try something else, but just starting over it just blows my mind. Like, I can't even fathom starting from zero subscribers. It's crazy. So I used to upload videos, get like three, four minutes worth of watch time and like get over almost five, 600 views. It was pretty good, pretty good days there. And to go from that to where we are right now, it kind of, I guess it already feels like I'm starting over, but it's really been really depressing, not gonna lie. I really don't want to make this video too long-winded, guys. I don't really don't want to waste your time, but it's really, really good to see you again, be back in front of the camera doing something. And for those of you who actually cared and watched up to this point, thank you so much. You, you genuinely mean a lot to me. And this is why I've continued YouTube all these years just because of people like you. Almost feels like a goodbye video, but not really. I'm not saying goodbye or anything. Uh, just kind of at a crossroad, you know? Maybe we'll talk about this. I need to start a Discord or something. Like, if I start a Discord, I'll put it in the bottom. We can chat. We can definitely chat there. And, uh... See if we can come up with some ideas together. Kind of came up with that off the spot. I, did, I really didn't know what I was going to say in this video. I was just like, I'm going to press record and just see what happens. So that's kind of where I'm at. So, I'll see you later, guys. Follow my Discord! If I even start it by now. Bye. <laughs>